a Washington state sheriff's deputy who was the first to respond to a 911 call about a home invasion was fatally shot late Sunday and a suspect is still on the loose, authorities said. The Pierce County Sheriff's Department identified the deputy as Daniel McCartney, 34. He was a U.S. Navy veteran and a married father of three sons. Overnight our department, our community and especially one of our families suffered an incredible loss, the Sheriff's Department said on its Facebook page. We are heartbroken. Someone called 911 just before 11.30 p.m. Sunday saying an intruder was inside a home in Fredrickson, a suburb just southeast of Tacoma. During the call, according to the Tacoma News Tribune, dispatchers heard screaming and the sounds of a scuffle. They alerted deputies, and McCartney arrived about six minutes later. The responding deputy encountered two burglary suspects, the department said. During the ensuing chase, police believe at least one of the suspects fired shots. Nationwide, police shot and killed nearly 1,000 people in 2017. When other law enforcement officers arrived, they found one of the suspects dead of a gunshot wound. Nearby, they discovered the fatally wounded deputy. McCartney was taken to a hospital, where he was pronounced dead around 2 a.m. Authorities have launched a manhunt for the other suspect and blocked off several roads in the suburb. It is with incredible sadness that inform you that our deputy has passed away from his injuries. We are with his family now, and we ask that you please keep his family, friends, and our department in your thoughts and prayers. Pick.twitter.com slash BMKKKE8QJI Read more, police shot and killed a man while trying to serve a warrant at the wrong house. A black off-duty cop tried to help stop a crime. Another officer shot him. I was just reading a book, Canadian cops called on black man reading C.S. Lewis in his car. After shootings, police fear being a public target even at lunch.